Hi guys, today I'm going to be demonstrating how to apply the individual lashes. Um, so let's get started. So as you can see, I've already taken them out of the pack. Um, and I have taken my um, eyelash glue. And I put some like, kind of off to the side in a tray. I'm just going to take the individual lashes and Now they suggest that you start like at the top, but I'm gonna try to apply them to the left, the bottom. So once you take the individual lash, you wanna kind of dip it in the, um, the eyelash pizza. And you wanna, and they say put them on top, but you kinda wanna put it onto your bottom lid. Like so. So I actually had to step away for a brief second to like um it on right but as you can see it's like a little white dot I put it close to my eyelash um, line as possible so right now I'm just waiting on it to really like dry and then you like do this all the way so you get to the end but you want to make sure that you're putting these individual lashes as close as possible you really can't tell the difference to my um, these are about the length of my regular um, eyelashes. So these are like basically the same. So as you can see, I'm not quite yet done with this eye and it's not completely like dried all the way. But it's coming out pretty nice. Um, and as I said before, I'm just simply like putting them um, along my lower, it actually is about upper lid but at the bottom which they really suggest you put them at the top but um I know a lot of people put them at the bottom when they do them. I mean you can either do either or honestly but um I'm gonna finish up this eye and then I'm gonna move on to the, the next eye and then I'll give you the final result so once again I'm taking the lash off of the, um, the block and then I'm going to dip it in, it's hard to see, but I'm going to dip it in the glue, like so, and I'm just blowing it to get it nice and tacky, and then I'm going to stick it right to the bottom of my And actually, I want to use the mirror for this so I don't like mess it up or get like hair in my eye. I'm finished with this eye. Um, really can't see a big huge difference because I got black short. I kind of wanted something a little conservative, not too, not too much, honestly. But I got black short, so next time I'll probably get medium. Um, but I've placed them, they're all like completely there. It's not actually finished drying yet, but um, when you're going through going through it and you're putting on your individual lashes, if you notice like any empty spaces, you can actually go back through, grab your lash and like I put a couple, I filled a couple in there just to give it a fuller look. Um, and I may do it again towards the end. But basically this eye is done um, and I'll probably put mascara on it to like make it really pop out because um, I'm really bright. And my hair is just like brown, so you really can't like see it really well. Um, so I'm probably gonna go through with a little bit of mascara, darken them up a little bit, and it'll, it should make them pop. But this is the difference between one eye being done and the other one not being done. So, finished result? Not finished result. Not so finished, I guess. Um, so I'm gonna finish uh, the other eye, and then I'll give you. So while I was waiting on my um, other eye to dry, kind of put on just a little bit of um, makeup. Okay, so um, I don't know. I really like how it turned out. This is my first time really wearing individuals. I think I had them once before, um, but I really don't wear them quite often. Um, but it's quick and easy. Um, you can save you about 20 bucks instead of going to the salon. 
Um, and these are the tools I basically use. I had this little, I already had this tool already. Um, these are just a pair of tweezers. And then I got a pack of, once again, the, the individual lashes. Um, it's INV by Kiss. Um, and as you can see, I use almost the first three rows, pretty much the first three rows. Um, I used, and I kind of cheated you guys. When I got the um, individual lashes, I thought I had glue at my house, and it ended up being the 16-hour um, adhesive for the strips. So we're gonna see how long this lasts. Probably shouldn't use this type of glue, but um, I don't know. We'll see how long it lasts. But I really like how it turned out. It's very conservative. Um, I actually. Uh, okay, so basically my lashes, it, it's the same one. Um, I think next time I'll go for the mediums because I got black short. Um, but definitely when I put the mascara on it, it's definitely going to pop. I'm still waiting on it to like completely dry before I attempt to touch them or do anything to them. But um, I mean... It's really conservative. Uh, it's the same length as my own lashes. It just makes my lashes look fuller, if that makes sense. So, um, once again, I, I really like how it turned out. This is, um, it's very easy. Like I said it before, just put them or attach them to like the bottom of your lid. Um, but you can do it. It's pretty easy. I thought it was going to actually be difficult, but it really wasn't. So you guys, thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe and comment. Positive comments, please. Thumbs up. Um, let me know if you have any uh, video ideas or questions. Um, you guys, bye.